My style of dancing, it's contemporary. I like doing a ballet contemporary twist to it, so it has a little classical technical side, as well as having emotion and concept behind it. Growing up as a dancer, I've done pretty much every kind of style, jazz, hip hop, lyrical, contemporary ballet, point, all that. I think my mom inspired me to do this show. You know, I've been watching it since season one. I never imagined myself on the show because I've never imagined myself doing commercial things. I'm much more of a company kind of person, dancer, a live performer. So to be commercially on something, it's so different for me, and she definitely, you know, encouraged and made me fearless towards things that I was scared of. <laughs> to win, I will have to really feel, I think, comfortable in every style. Since I love contemporary so much, I can't show that I'm gonna be scared to do hip hop. And if I'm scared to do hip hop, you're obviously not gonna come across, you know, strong and you have to be strong in order to win the competition. This show is an incredible boost for a dance career, and that doesn't happen a lot with other dance opportunities. It's an amazing confidence booster already. It's boosted my confidence, and it opens new doors for a dancer's life and future. My style of dance is contemporary, and I chose this style. It's um, just my favorite, it's emotional and has passion behind it. Oh gosh, um, to be in the top 20, it's absolutely incredible. Um, I feel like such a princess. I'm um, getting my hair and makeup done, it's amazing, I love it. I think my mom inspired me to do this show. You know, I've been watching it um, since season one. Um, I never imagined myself on the show because I've never imagined myself doing commercial things. I'm much more of a company kind of person, dancer, a live performer. Um, so to be commercially on something, it's so different for me. And she definitely, you know, encouraged and made me fearless towards things that I was scared of. <laughs> um, I'd have to say my strength as a dancer would be um, my emotion um, and connecting to pieces um, and being like really honest with movement and intention towards choreography. Um, I'd have to say the most memorable thing um, would be Vegas week. That whole process was absolutely insane. It's like a roller coaster of emotions. You're happy, you're sad, you're excited, you're nervous, you're hurting, you're sore. Like, I don't know how you can forget <laughs> that week. I would have to say the three most important things um, for before I'm going on stage would be to calm myself down. My heart will be like freaking out. So calming myself down, uh, like focusing. Um, if it's with a partner, um, kind of getting on the same page with my partner so we kind of feel each other's energy and we're on the same like wavelength. And third, to not care about what anyone else thinks. To really um, to feel like my opinion is what matters most and I just want to make myself happy with my performance. Probably the best advice that I've been given throughout this whole process would be from my mom and that's just to not expect anything, to live in the moment and to not really want something, but to, just to like live in the moment and let everything happen and love what happens when it happens and not expect something huge.